For the Daily Commercial News in 90, I'm Michelle Wargo. The Lake County Commission unanimously approved construction of Miracle Field, the first of its kind in Lake County and the second in Central Florida for children with special needs. The field will be constructed at Lake Idamir Park in Tavares and the $400,000 field could be completed by December. Expect to share the road this weekend in Mount Dora. It's time for the Mount Dora Bicycle Festival, which promises three full days of rides with 13 different routes to choose from during the three-day event, incorporating varying abilities, speeds, and terrain. For more information or to register, visit this website. If you're traveling down Main Street in Leesburg, you'll see the Scarecrow Expo lining both sides of the street. This popular expo takes place every year and is hosted by the Leesburg Partnership. Also along Main Street this week was the Leesburg High School Homecoming Parade. It ran down Main Street through downtown and ended at the First Baptist Church of Leesburg. The weather held out nicely for the fourth annual Wings and Wildflowers Festival last weekend. The event featured trips and presentations of Lake County's flora and fauna. James Curry of Nikon's Birding Adventures TV was once again a guest speaker. United Way of Lake and Sumter Counties is now offering grant opportunities through its Community Impact Fund for agencies who have programs working toward the same community level goals. The Community Impact Fund invests in health and human services in Lake and Sumter Counties. For more information or to apply for a United Way Community Impact Grant, visit this website. For more information on these stories, visit dailycommercial.com. That's this week's Daily Commercial News in 90 on LSTV. I'm Michelle Wargo.